We good. Put this here. Floor three. I really want the shop right about now. Yes? Are you all right, ma'am? Ishimura, Ship Systems Department. What are these things anyway? Oh, they're garbage cans. Comms relay. You can't attack me here. There's a safe station here. You can't attack me. That's our unspoken agreement. Break room. What the hell? What's that? A recording? Huh. Must be the marker they dug up. So it is the same. That marker. That's the symbol of the Church of Unitology. It didn't take you for a believer, Isaac. My mother was. But if they found this on some alien planet, what does that mean? That Unitology's onto something? Unitology's full of shit. Forget it. How did they know it was gonna be here to begin with? Did they accidentally find it? Actually kind of seems like that might not be the case. They came here on a mission because they knew exactly that the marker was gonna be on this planet. Unitology article. United, we ascend? Is Unitology a new hope or just another scam? By Carrie Van Otken. If you've been living on Mars for the past 200 years, you might have missed the fastest growing religious movement in history. Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEOs and officials in its ranks, claims 78 billion of stock of multi-global companies, and owns two of Earth's largest financial institutions, GPSG Financial and Unitas Energy Investments. From its beginnings as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected, established religion. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, oh, Altman, a respected geophysicist, blew the whistle on what he claimed to be the biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government. The discovery of an artifact, or marker, which proved beyond any doubt that there is alien life in the universe. The government labeled Altman a cook, but his claim struck a chord with some, and his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest, along with civil unrest and demands for action. Unitologists believe the marker contained a code, the key to eternal life, through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. Oh, okay. They say the government is hiding the marker somewhere, keeping its secrets for themselves. Across all of human space, Unitologists praise Altman's martyrdom and await the day God comes to take them to their new life beyond death. It all sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of its critics believe there are at least three ranks above the average believer, or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner workings and research is revealed to a follower. And these ranks are achieved by one simple criteria, giving money and power to the church. Hmm... Think taking all your money's bad? The church also requires their members to donate their bodies after death. Why? What do they do with them? Nobody will say, and attempts to infiltrate the inner circle have failed. With their emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe we wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumor that also refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding program. Some claim to have seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has ever been supplied, but the claimants all say these mausoleum ships, despite their huge size. Da 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 da. Now, Isaac never got his mom's body back. Hmm. We, I think one of the earliest text logs we had mentioned something called the black marker. Maybe that's the, the first marker ever found. Normally things like religious belief is, it's very intangible and spiritual, but the presence of the marker, the marker is a concrete real thing. And I feel like that gives it a, 
an air of legitimacy for those who are susceptible to falling to this... Well, it's not a religion, right? It's a cult. The only way to rise up in ranks is not by faith or strong belief, but simply by giving money. I don't know about that, man. Somebody was starting a freaking... Look, they were doing some kind of a ritual here. It was like footprints and handprints. Let's get out of here. I don't think Isaac would enjoy seeing that very much, especially since he, you know, his mom was a victim. Oh god. Gotta make sure they're all dead. Can I go in? Oh, I got a... Um, mm, which bullet do I not care about? I care about all of them, really. The cheapest one would probably be the pulse rifle, I think. Yeah, we can start using it again. Got a good few bullets. I'll use it on the... Contact beam? Oh, I could have just thrown something at it. I'm a dummy. <laughs> it's fine. Comms access hall locked. Nothing here. What's a goodies? Oh, stasis! Oh, I shouldn't have used the pack. Oh well. I don't think it would fit in my inventory anyway. I've got way too much stuff right now. Oh, seriously? Oh, I can't even get the upgrade. You're joking me. You're joking me. I've got too much stuff. The plasma energy. Okay, if I... If I shoot some bullets, maybe later on I can come back and pick it up. But for now, I can't. That's frustrating. Let's go then. Every time. Electrical systems. Don't believe- oh! Okay, that works. Oh, maybe that was a tutorial thing. Wasted my little thing. Okay, that works. Damn. Little dude die? Take off your arm. Do you have a stinger? I'd like a stinger more than your head. Your head's useless. From above me? Thank you. Actually, I don't feel too bad about this area. It's really confined. So I feel fairly safe. Oh. 
At least they're not smart enough to avoid that. We've got more stasis. Continue on. Now the area is getting a bit bigger. Oh, okay. Hello, hello. Are you good? Oh no, I've completely run out. Oh, you're dead. Well, that was fast. Oh, dude, I'm completely out of plasma cutter rounds. That was fast. In that case, I'm gonna use the... Yeah, let's use the contact beam again. For now. And then the pulse rifle will be my main thing. Maybe I upgraded my plasma cutter so it's really, really good. That's why I died so fast. Thank you very much. Emergency evacuation instructions. Important! Oh my god, I'm not gonna read all this. <laughs> Use in non-emergency situations may lead to criminal prosecution. Fire extinguishers located at the far end of all escape pod rooms. Emergency phones are located every 800 feet and are marked by a blue light. Lift receiver and dial zero for a direct line to the bridge. Leave all large personal items. Help others that need assistance. Do not panic or run or use lifts. Ah, they agree! Don't use elevators during emergencies. It's really important. Safety brochures contain detailed information available from any shift manager. Make sure fire doors are not obstructed. Look out for overloaded sockets. Danger, do not touch high voltage paddle units, which protrude from underneath the escape pods. Wait, it's all talking about the escape pods. In case of fire, sound fire alarm, alert others, locate exits and extinguishers. Don't stop to assist injured people unless you are qualified. Remain calm and move quickly. Wouldn't say that's bad advice. Hold up. This looks a bit... Uh... Oh, do I have to stasis that? Stasis works on everything. Power transferred from electrical systems to ADS cannons. We got it. The ADS cannons are back online. We... Wait, auto-targeting offline. Calibration data not found. Fuck. No auto-targeting. The cannons are useless. What? What about manual targeting? You want to go out there with all that shit raining down and target the ADS cannons manually? If I give the cannons enough targeting data, it'll recalibrate the system. You got a better idea? Christ. I'll open exterior access. I hope you know what you're doing. Don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm doing. At all. I guess... <laughs> I guess we're continuing on. Calibrate. The three cannons. Wait. Wait, what do you mean? There's no... It's not showing me anywhere. Mm, there's a locked door here. Does that actually go anywhere? Is that just locked? Hold up. I remember. Weapon upgrade. Thank you. Stasis. Yeah. Right, it just says calibrate three ADS cannons, but it doesn't tell me where to go. Different floor? Floor six! Okay, I'm on floor one right now? Well, I probably gotta go back to the elevator first. Let's just go, man.
Yeah, it only goes up to floor 3 here. Maybe because we have to take another elevator. Back in the main lobby. I think we should go to the shop first. Offload a little bit. Upgrade my rig. Such a long trip. some little dudes. We're fine. Okay, the store was here. I think I've walked around with the this rig for a while enough. Let's upgrade and switch back. Yeah, level three. It looks different every level, right? Does it? Actually haven't been paying that close attention. But we'll see. So if I want to switch back, it would be... How do I switch back? Which one's the normal one? Whoa, bloody suit. Have you remembered whose blood it is yet? What? Infested suit. When your mission is to save the one you love, not even death can stop you. Ooh. I don't think any of these are the ones that I was using. Oh, unequip. I see. Now we can officially get the upgrade. Which costs... I have enough money for it. Great. Increases inventory to 22. 10% armor. Fantastic. Why don't we just stay inside this little hole forever? No necromorphs would be able to come in. Wait for someone to come save us. All right, sweet. Now we could... We should probably sell the semiconductors. Even more money, heck yeah. And with our new slots, we should be okay, inventory-wise. But, do we want to carry five weapons? Probably not. It's not going to make a big difference though, because you're going to continue picking up ammo for the weapon that you have in storage, which is going to take up slots. Hmm, I like everything we have, honestly. I feel like we need the flamethrower for the little guys. And I like the ripper. So I guess I'll put away the contact beam for now then. I like it. I actually do like it, it's just that I don't have much room. Don't want to overload myself. Pick it up for now, and then we'll switch once we run out of ammo for something. Yeah, seems good to me. And then, do we have enough money? No, we don't. Not for another upgrade. It's not worth it buying the node. So we'll just leave it here. to have a- oh! I guess at some point we can open this. But not yet. Level 2 door, hold up. There's a level 2 door that was- it's right here. Clearance confirmed. Sweet. Yeah, more money already. <laughs> You're not gonna come out of that, are you? 
Oh! Oh, I forgot about my uh, lack of pulse cutter energy. I have a little bit now. Not the most. I don't feel comfortable leaving the plasma cutter at home, though. Because that's like my number one thing. I think we'll be fine. Okay, now you want me to go to level floor 6 somehow. Probably back here? Is it on the other end? No? Wait, 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 wait! I thought you were gonna show me the floors. Yeah. Oh, actually, we did come to the right place. Right, because there was that one locked elevator at the end of this. Right, okay. Accidentally did the right thing. Okay, that's not even English. I don't know- what the hell? That might be some unitology stuff. Who knows? Yeah, it's open. Not sure if this is sharp enough. <laughs> There's another save point. What's the plan? I'll seek a few of the ADS cannons to one of my tools. I target an asteroid, the cannons take it out, and I recalibrate the system. We're out of options. Do it. Okay. Security request retrieved. God. Someone stop him! This is Second Officer Sheik. I need security here right now. No one's coming. White, for Christ's sake, step away from the controls. We need our first officer. Captain Matthias is dead. The captain's dead. Vincent's security team is dead. Who's left? Step away from the airlock. That's an order. Who's left, Sheik? A crew full of uni fanatics? Eckhart screwed us good, didn't he? If a CEC director could go that bad, maybe the whole company's rotten to the core. Just like Aegis 7. You think CEC won't send a rescue team for their precious planet cracker? Think white. We just need to hold on. Yes. You probably should. No! Oh! oh Lord, you goddamn fool! Feel it! Do the airlock now! People are panicking pretty badly here. They weren't wrong though. We're the team. We're the team sent here to save them. But, except half of us are already dead. Literally three people left in our crew. And I just don't know if we can really help you all. We haven't seen an actual alive person in so long. I'm just like, ah. Uh. Entering vacuum. Entering zero gravity. Sink a tool with ADS cannon, then call a strike against asteroids to recalibrate the cannon's targeting. Okay, we gotta go. We're timed. There's some asteroids coming down to get me. Sinking targeting system. Destroy. Wait. How does this work? Oh, like, wherever I'm pointing is... Is where the strike gets called? Warning. Hull integrity compromised. 
It'll be very complete. Cannon auto targeting online. You're joking, I have no air. No! Where's the air? Where's the air? Oh! Oh, it was right here. <laughs> Panic setting in. Hurry up, my guy. Sinking targeting system. Warning. Hull integrity compromised. Yeah, we're working on it. We're we're working on it. Calibration complete. Cannon auto targeting online. Oh my gosh. We got it, we got it. Sinking targeting system. I can't believe how easy the sync process is. Insanely convenient. Maybe also a little bit dangerous. Something hit me, I don't know what. Asteroid piece. What the hell is hitting me? Oh, dude! You're crazy if you think I got time for this. Maybe I should have just called a strike on it. Data migration complete. ADS recalibrated. Auto targeting systems enabled. They're back. The ADS cannons are online ship wide. Thank God. Engaging autopilot. Get yourself inside, Isaac. I think I figured out our next move. Better give me all your crap for all the trouble you caused me. Okay, we're fine here. There's something there! What is that? White's rig! Oh, this is for one of the side quests, I think? Turn around, turn around. Turning. Now they're all doing some auto-targeting stuff. Forget about everything else. Let's go! And we're good. Exiting zero gravity. Exiting vacuum. Oh, I still got the limb here. You all happy? Isaac, Tamman, I just intercepted a transmission for medical. Someone's down there? See what you make of this. <laughs> this is senior medical officer Nicole Brennan. Nicole! Medical is a sanctuary. All survivors, please join us. Nicole, I'm going back to medical. Makes sense. I'll head to the crew deck and look for survivors from the bridge. I'll be in touch. Sanctuary? Wonder if you know something we don't. Oh, I thought we were... Hmm, okay. Hey, there we go. Lethal Devotion. Oh, what the hell are you? Were those the same as the stuff we normally see? It was... Yeah, I don't know, it had a gigantic head. But the way they said that kind of sounded weird. It's a sanctuary? I mean, sure, I guess. You are not authorized engineering. We are at bridge right now. We hangar. Engineering. The rest of these are not accessible yet. Even the bridge one? Well, alright.
Continue. Medical Bay... That was the place where we found all of the doctors' office, right? It's a place we're familiar with, which means there's definitely gonna be new things as we double back. Hammond, are you sure I can't visit you? Sure, you were... I guess you were here before. The way it was moving made me think it was a new thingy. Trying to trick me. Yeah, we're not registered crew. Can't go there. I think we're okay right now. The upgrades, it would be nice to get. Gonna hold off though. Yeah, because we have some other upgrades that we haven't even applied yet. Oh, actually, with that semiconductor, maybe it's a better bet to just get another one, because our space should be okay. Pulse rifle upgrade. Ripper? Ripper's always gonna be good. But I'll get a pulse rifle this time. How about that? Yeah. Just to spread it out a little bit. Actually, I don't have that many bullets for... Whoa, why is it so blurry? Yeah, I don't have that many bullets for the pulse rifle either. The tram station has got to be a safe place. Can't make it not safe. Medical. Medical. Why do I get the impression there's no way we're gonna see Nicole that soon? I hope I'm wrong. But if I see Nicole, forget about everything else. I'm getting the heck out of here with my girlfriend. And that's the end of that. Medical lab? Broadcast. Uh, were these here before? Honestly, I don't even remember anymore. I get kind of freaked out thinking it might not be. But if we're seeing dead creatures that are new, that means someone else here is killing them as well, which actually would make me happy. Now let's have a look here. Because we're returning. This time, there will probably be places where we couldn't visit it before, but we can now. It just to be a little bit... like, locked rooms? No, these ones we have opened up, I think? Oh, this one we haven't. This is where we're trying to go. There's a level 2 room on this side. Emergency equipment storage. Mercer's room. Locked. I don't know if that kind of locked means I couldn't open it before, or... But I feel pretty confident. Ah, this is the long hallway. I feel pretty confident we'll probably go back here because there was a random oxygen thingy. And it wasn't a vacuum there. So I'm just gonna... I'll follow what it tells me to do for now. That's fine. What the hell? Another survivor. At last. You'll be safe here. I'm a doctor. 
Is Nicole Brennan with you? You're not here for sanctuary then. No, well, I am. Dr. Brennan's currently engaged. Shall I send you to her? How about you unlock these doors and I'll find her myself? Are you that selfish? You might let something in. Or out. Shit. So, you've decided to be difficult. Take a seat. I'll deal with you momentarily. Oh no, I'm stuck again. I'm stuck on whatever it is I'm stuck on. <laughs> no, come on. Alright. Is he coming out? That guy definitely didn't sound normal. And the way he locked the door behind me like that. I expect a little bit of panic, something like that, but that guy was just very calm and... Clearance knows confirmed. about the sanctuary as well. I don't know. I don't have a good feeling about this. There's only one way. Please don't shoot. Please don't shoot. Don't have very many bullets. Ugh. This is good. That was me. Oh, we're back to the place where the guy banged his head on the wall. Wait. Kindly avoid disturbing my other patients. What is this? Research, of course. I'm so close to finding that missing factor. A unitologist would understand. I'm hesitating between finishing them off or not, because if I do, it might piss off the doctor immediately. But if I don't, they might come back. Oh god. No, let's do something about this right now. Oh, I can't. I actually can't. They won't let me. Okay. Have we been here before? I don't recognize this place. I don't think so. And yeah, they won't let me. Do we know this doctor's name? Clearly a unitologist. Will he get mad? Oh, I was hoping the cup would... They're still writhing. Well, for the moment, are they... Their heads are all wrapped up. I can't even tell if they're alive or not. Are they in the process of turning? What? I don't know. So why did I do that then? Did it open up? I can't go there. Whoa. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, shoot! The one enemy I shouldn't have used the Ripper on. It had some instant kill melee attack. Damn! Okay, we gotta get it from a distance, but with what? I don't actually have that many bullets for anything. Whoa. What the hell? 
Oh my god. How close can I get? Oh, the tentacles are slowly coming off, I think. Oh! Dude, stop! Oh. Better give me something for all that trouble. Now I remember this room. It's this room. It's just that it changed so much, I completely don't recognize it anymore. That's all. Gotta go up. Just check in. Ah, uh, they mean for me to come back as part of the main story anyway. That's good. So I don't really have to go out of my way specifically to, um, or too much anyway. To try to grab all the stuff, I think. Level 3, pulse rifle upgrade, one more node. Pulse rifle upgrade, another one? We have two? Oh, sweet. That might have been a little bit too much for the pulse rifle then. I forgot we had another one already. Suit. I don't even know where it extended. Health would be nice. Four upgrades in total. Size, stasis zone. Is that the most important thing though? I kind of feel like going a little bit more aggressive, but. Okay, ammo-wise? Just want to check how much ammo I have of everything right now. <laughs> Very little plasma cutter energy. Well, we'll have to make everything count then, huh? I'm not sure what the weak spot of the guy on the wall was. The tentacles. Oh yeah, okay. Well, damage, I think, is an easy one. And then the special... Greatly increases rate of fire. It's fast enough as it is. Greatly increases ammo capacity. In the clip, right? Not, like, overall capacity? Actually, not too sure which one it is. Reload capacity... Well, all the damage ones are a little bit... Oh, I can do another damage one. Yeah, normally I'd probably go for the plasma cutter a little bit more, but since we don't have that much energy for the moment. I left this place for like an hour and now everything is all messed up. I don't even have that many bullets for the pulse rifle either. That's great. That was open before, wasn't it? Actually, I don't remember. Oh. Okay, the ground definitely wasn't like this before. No? Yeah, I remember. This is where we had the... Other incident. Somebody put the lights- it's like a- oh my god, they're conducting a ritual. That's what they're doing. Now, am I allowed to... Kinesis that thing over? No, 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 the platform. It's stuck there now. Is this poppable? Yeah, it doesn't look like it's poppable. I don't want to waste bullets on this. Got anything good here? See you. The Ripper is really good. 
We have to get really close, but because it's so good, it interrupts them. So we don't have to worry too much. Well, I don't think we're going in that way. Unless if I pop something inside. Just hanging back, making sure it's safe. It's spreading so fast. Not a good sign. <laughs> 